Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any future videos. Apple just announced their September event a couple of days ago, and I'm here to get you up to date with everything that's going to happen during the event. First things first, it's very unlikely that the new iPhones will be announced at this event. Although historically the iPhone has been announced every year at the September event, 2020 has been a weird one, and because of that, the iPhones most likely still aren't ready for release and will be announced in October. Two products that we know are being announced are the new Apple Watch 6 and the iPad Air 4. The Apple Watch's new big features this year will be a blood oxygen detector, a longer battery life and sleep tracking, adding to its already wide variety of health monitoring features. As for the design, rumours say it's not changing at all, and will feature the same design as the Apple Watch Series 4 and 5. Another product that is basically confirmed to be announced at this event is the iPad Air 4, which is rumoured to have a design change to the same boxy design and edge-to-edge -edge display like the iPad Pro. However, this iPad will not feature Face ID and instead will have Touch ID embedded into the power button as multiple leaks suggest. This iPad Air 4 will serve as the middle ground between the regular iPad and the iPad Pro. AirPod Studio are a new over-ear headphone that Apple is making to compete with other companies such as Bose or Sony. They are rumoured to feature active noise cancellation like the AirPods Pro. They will also have head and neck detection to pause and play the music. For example, if the headphones are over your ears, the music will play. If the headphones are down around your neck, the music will pause. These are rumoured to cost about $350. US we might see a new budget model of the HomePod called the HomePod Mini. We don't exactly know much about any new features coming to this. It will probably just be a cheaper budget version of the original HomePod made to compete with other reasonably priced smart speakers such as Google Nest Mini and Amazon Echo Dot. Some rumours indicate that we could see a new Apple TV with an upgraded processor and maybe a different design for the remote, but not much else is known about this new device. It's been leaked that Apple will release a new Mac with Apple made silicon before the end of 2020, but most likely won't announce it at this year's September event, and will probably be released at another event later in the year, in October, with the iPhones. AirPower is a wireless charging mat that was designed to charge three devices simultaneously, such as the iPhone, Apple Watch and AirPods. It was announced in September of 2017 and was later cancelled in 2019. But in June of 2020, a leaker by the name of John Prosser claimed to have pictures of the charging pad back in development, and could be released at this year's September event, but nothing more is really known so we have to take this one with a grain of salt. And finally, AirTags. AirTags are little tracking devices that can be used to find lost items. If you're wondering how they will work, think of the tile tracker and imagine it with an Apple design and features. These were confirmed to be real in April of 2020 by Apple themselves, but with no official release date. So we are unsure if they will be announced at the September event or not. That's all for today's video, thank you so much for watching. Make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss any future videos, and I'll see you in the next one. Later!